A Brainerd couple is still hospitalized tonight after they lost control of their boat on Friday and were viciously hurled into an area lake. Residents jumped in, residents in the area jumped into action in an attempt to save their lives after they, after they realized the boat was repeatedly striking the couple. Our Logan Gay has more. What you are now seeing is the aftermath of a horrific scene from last Friday, where a couple was almost mangled to death by their own boat. For Lori Sweet and Timothy Bama, it started off as a peaceful day on the lake, but it quickly turned into a fight for their lives. When they were launched into the frigid waters and their boat went into a dangerous spin, commonly known as the circle of death. She was in the back of the boat and holding the stern and her phone had rang and she got up to answer it. And when she got up, she let her go of the stern and instantly the boat will go into the circle of death. Neighbors quickly jumped into action once they heard the dreadful cries for help. And I could hear the bloody scream from her as she was being hit. And then I just you know, went frantically into the house and I grabbed the phone, yelled at my wife. The grandkids started crying and I said, they're just being chewed up out there. When the Samaritans finally arrived to the scene, they found the victims badly injured and barely above the water. They were able to get Bama on the boat, but Sweet was so injured, they were forced to tow her back to shore. Gary and Tim actually hung on to her that whole time, and we went as fast as we could. And it was on this very ledge that Rice Lake resident Gary Sheeler held Lori Sweet's head above water as they made that long trek back to shore. And as she slowly went into shock, he promised her that he would not let go. I just kept saying to myself, get the strength, get the strength to hang on. Don't let go because um, it's over. You know, um, you know, in this kind of water, you're not going to find her. Authorities were able to meet them at the shoreline and help pull the victims out of the water. They praised the Samaritans for their courage and quick thinking. Thanks to the public. Um, we had a fairly quick response, but we're never the first there. We need the uh, people that are on shore or those that can lend a hand safely to do so. The rescuers are happy everything turned out okay. However, they don't think of their actions as heroic. Good Samaritan people, will, there's so many of us out there that will just take it, you know, when you see you have to do something, it's an instinct to go do it. And Brainerd, Logan Gay, Lakeland News. Lori Sweet lost her ring finger on her right hand and suffered some head trauma and a crushed wrist. Her fiance, Timothy Bama, suffered some scrapes and bruises. Both are expected to make full recoveries. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.